Greetings from Northamptonshire as Coventry United continue their travels in the United Counties League Premier Division Saturday's match sees the Red and Greens arrive at Compton Park in the quaint village of Coganhoe to face mid-table Coganhoe United. You won't miss a thing here on CUTV with Liam Cook. First team coach Ivan Lawton makes two changes to the side who breezed past Obi midweek. Tyler Donaldson replaces Joe Smith in the back three alongside Don Perkins and Kane Thomas. Tyler Haddo limped off in that 4 2 victory with a foot injury. Charlie Faulkner took his place up front on Tuesday and does so again today. Kyle Carey retains his place in the side. The suspension for his red card will be served next week, while Joe Keynes returns to the bench after suffering a separated shoulder against Wolves last month. Guggenheim's form has took a dive recently, the home side having lost their last four fixtures. They make three changes today from their latest loss at Bugbrook on Tuesday. Evandro Montero and Chief Boateng drop to the bench while there's no place in the squad for Rico Alexander. Jack Norman steps in up front alongside top scorer Dylan Wilson, while Ryan Archer and Alex Vaughan firm up the back line. Bates slips it down the left hand side and locked it over the woodwork by Dylan Wilson the Cook's top scorer As Francis darted off his line putting the number 9 under pressure and he won that battle of wills Sawyer the wing back Finds Kyle Carey. Ellis. Follows it back to Harry Sawyer. It's Carey once more. Crossing opportunity, curving Ellis waiting. Hilton at the far post too. Carey. Liam Cairns, low drive. Flick up by Ellis. Just wide. Shikosh. Watching on the left with Josh Allen. goes down the centre to Norman. Plays Kogan Ho right into trouble. But Charlie Faulkner sends his effort flying over the bar. Looking to chip the goalkeeper Foxhall, but it didn't quite work out as he planned. So Joe Blow has been intercepted on the left. Oh, surely be a free kick, will it? No. Could have been a free kick in favour of Kogan Ho. The Number 11, Wakeley dragged down, but United will continue. It's Kyle Carey receiving it from Faulkner, off the post. Carey rounded the goalkeeper, the goal at his mercy. Adams delivery, and they have scored, but it's offside, it won't count. Riley found unmarked. And playing it past Reese Francis into the net, but the flag was immediately raised on this near side. And Kokonos open air is chalked off. Fucked up field down the left side, a curling ball by Perkins. And Faulkner, that's a penalty for Coventry United. A lunge in by Riley, tripping the United number nine. Riley protests, but I don't think he can have any complaints. Kyle Carey has been in the form of his life recently. Can he keep that form going? With this penalty against Foxhall, straight down the middle. Kyle Carey, right on the half hour mark, gives Coventry United the lead. Nerves of steel, only to be expected from Kyle Carey. And Coventry United take the advantage, 1-0 to the Red and Greens. Now striding away is Bates. Strong challenge by Carey, but a fair one. Ellis ensures that Riley can't bring it back. Kevin Ellis, across to Sawyer. Sawyer in. Vaughan only as far as Hilton! Put some power behind that! Tom Perkins up there too, Charlie Faulkner in and around the penalty area. And Carey making himself available too. It's Blowers in towards Faulkner, it's tipping! And tipped onto the roof of the net by Craig Foxall. It was dipping under the crossbar for sure. It was a save that had to be made. Carey's already got a goal to his crate today. Can he set up one? Towards Ellis! He grazed the woodwork on its way out.
Going up to 15 minutes into the second half. United at the moment with that slender one goal lead. Can they bulk it up a bit with Jarrell Hilton charging towards the box down the left hand side? Hilton crossing over Trini. Curry Ellis on the bar! First time ever from Curry Ellis smacks off the woodwork. That's Kogan Ho breaking. Vaughan. He's beaten Thomas. And the referee has given a free kick on the right side of the penalty area. Hogan Ho have got to try and make opportunities like this work if they take anything from this match. Low drive towards the near post. It's found its way in. <laughs> Kogano have equalised! And Archer has got the final touch! They're all trickling through a crowded penalty area! And somehow Archer able to get a touch and divert it home. And the running greens are back to square one. Kogan High one, Coventry one. Adams wants options. Floated over the United defence. Wilson to complete the comeback, squares it. Oh, and was, it, was it Don Perky who sent it over? It was. Low drive from Will Bates. Destined for the back of the net if it wasn't for the last ditch intervention of Don Perkins flicking it over the crossbar. Sent into the area for Wakely again from Josh Adams. Wakely's ball. And headed into his own net. By Joe Cairns. Not the return that Cairns would have wanted. Trying to head it out for the corner. But Kogan Ho accept the gift from the Coventry United substitute and take the lead at Compton Park. Kogan Ho 2, Coventry 1. Liam Cairns. Don Perkins. Lost it in towards Sawyer. Pushes it down for Curry Ellis. Brilliant save. And it's in. Foxall did exceptionally well to save the initial effort. But it wasn't enough to stop the powerful strike from Kirvin Ellis. And with 15 minutes to go, it's honours even at Compton Park. United aren't down and out just yet. Kogan Ho 2, Coventry United 2. Joe Blowers with the free kick. All but one back for Kogan Ho. They don't want to lose this point. Can Coventry snatch it away from them? It's towards Donaldson. Cairns at the far post. Offside flag raised. The offside flag is raised. United absolutely furious as Kyle Carey scored an absolute beauty. And the referee, I think, wants to have a word with the linesman. Well, United putting their point across, it was an absolutely emphatic finish by Kyle Carey. And the goal will not count. Referee has confirmed offside. Archer and Carey both up for the header off the heel of Kyle Carey. Joe Cairns, Carey up for it again. Perkins up there too. Perkins shoulder to shoulder with Shekosh. And now it's Curry and Ellis racing down the right hand side. Carey making himself available in the penalty area. Still Ellis looking to take on Adams. It's Ellis going all the way. Curry Ellis through the legs of the defender. Has it crossed the line? No, it hasn't. It's a free kick anyway on the goalkeeper. <laughs> And at last the referee brings the game to a close. United frustrated, feeling that they had a perfectly good winning goal, chalked off for offside. But for the first time this season, the Red and Greens have been held to a draw. Full-time score at Compton Park, Coganho United 2, Coventry United 2.